In this video, I'm going to show you how to get the channel for your NES emulator known as FCE Ultra GX. Now this is a very easy process, it doesn't even involve installing a WAD. All you need to do is put an app on your SD card or USB drive. So all you need is your SD card or USB drive that you use to hold your apps for your homebrewed Wii and a computer to get the file. So if you go to the link in the description, just click on download. It should take you to this page and then you should see channel installer here. Just click on it. You should download. Now I'm doing this for the Wii. If you want the VWii channel, you select this, this link and that's where you get your channel installer for the VWii. So make sure you're getting the right one. But once that's downloaded, just click the file and open it up and bring up your SD card or USB drive. I'm currently using a USB drive to hold my apps. So in the WinRAR file, you'll need something to extract it as well. WinRAR is free if you want to use that or 7-zip works as well. Just double click on apps and drag FC, FCE GX channel installer into your apps folder. So once that's transferred, just go into your apps folder and you should see FCE FCEU GX channel installer. Open it up and you should have these three files. And that's all you need to do on the computer. So I'm going to unplug my USB drive and meet you over on the Wii. And once you're over on your Wii, just go to the homebrew channel, start it up. And here you should find your FCE Ultra GX channel installer. Just click on it and press load. Now you need to make sure you have the emulator first before you do this, otherwise it could corrupt your storage device. So just don't try to install any channels that you don't have the actual emulator for. But it'll bring this prompt, do you want this, do you want to install this channel? Just click install. And once you get this, just press OK. So exit to the system menu and let's check it out. And there we go, the FCE Ultra GX channel. And it's as simple as that. But that's basically it for the tutorial. If you ran into any issues, just comment below and I'll try to get back to you to help. Uh, but otherwise, I hope you enjoy your new NES emulator channel. And I'll see you on the next one. Take care.